Samsung software is often a cause for complaint with many users, but with Android Pie, the company is making some big improvements with the debut of One UI. Now that it's in beta, let's take a look at some of the best changes. Samsung has designed its various apps to better fit its very tall displays, such as what you find on the Galaxy S9 Plus or the Note 9. Commonly used tabs have moved from the top of the display to the bottom, and all of the content in general is just easier to access without any hand gymnastics. A subtler touch in One UI is the addition of some better animations. You'll probably not notice this unless you look at One UI and Samsung Experience side by side, but the various animations throughout are faster, smoother, and just better. A huge gripe over the years for me with Samsung software has been the cluttered settings menu. While One UI doesn't do a whole lot to condense the settings down, it does offer a cleaner overall look. It feels better organized and easier to navigate through. Gesture navigation also debuts with Samsung's One UI. While it's not the same set of gestures you'll find from Google, it's actually slightly more intuitive. Simple swipes from the bottom of each third of the display access back, home, and recents. You can even toggle on small visual indicators to make things just a bit easier to understand. The biggest improvement for many people though will be the addition of a system-wide dark mode. This is something Android users have been asking for for years now. Google is slowly implementing dark mode into its various apps and parts of Android, but with One UI, Samsung has delivered it through the entire system as well as its first party apps. It's an excellent change that I hope more OEMs follow with, especially Google. Samsung is currently beta testing One UI on the Galaxy S9 and S9 Plus, and it should start on the Note 9 soon as well. It'll start rolling out to all users early next year. Check out 9to5Google for more coverage on One UI and Samsung in general, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this.